So just so you know, when I told him that you couldn't make it from the airport, he said that you made that up because you wanted to go on a date. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to a wonderful, beautiful day here in the Bingham household. Welcome back to our life in Holland. If you're new to our channel, guys, welcome. Thank you for being here. We're almost to 100K, guys. Thank you so much. Help us get there. I've got Turn Bingham here, who's the newest teenager here at the Bingham household. In fact, the only teenager here at the Bingham household. Turn's always had really good hair, which you know we've been grateful for. He's got kind of that nice wave, right, when he combs his hair. And uh, anyway, so this morning, as we are, you know, getting ready for the day and things like that, and getting ready to go to church, I was tossing Ava's slime up in my room. And it hit the ceiling, right? And I like just barely turned my head, and it just fell it right just on my head. just it just looked for a moment. I tried over. to rip it as fast as I could, but <laughs> and it, it landed stuck. in his hair, everybody. And that is now the result. <laughs> Of him not paying attention for the slime ball coming back down. So, I guess as a teenager, what you do is, well, you uh, get in trouble a little bit more. I guess this classifies as that. <laughs> Why don't we just buzz my head? Should we? No. Guys, comment down below right now if you feel no. like we should buzz Turn Bingham's head right now to get rid of this slime. <laughs> no. Oh, last time we buzzed your head? Oh my gosh. Guys, if you've not seen the hair prank video, you have to go check that out. It was actually quite hilarious. All right, let's see if we can get this stuff out of his hair. A few moments later. Okay, we realized we look entirely different than we looked about 30 seconds ago. About two seconds ago, actually. My beard was just bugging me so much that I had to actually get rid of it. And uh, in the meantime, we managed to actually get this far. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't done anything with it. So we read on the line that apparently it is what shampoo and conditioner and hot water will get that out. So we probably think it's best to maybe jump in the shower here to get this done. I'm trying to convince him though to just kind of keep it. If you kind of like flail it out a little bit, it actually looks really trend. nice. So Tur, here, hold it out. Like move all the clean, there we go. Move all the clean hair out of there real quick. This hurts so bad. Oh gosh. Here, if I can get to the root. Let me get to the root here real quick. Okay, here. Ready? Mm -hmm. Are you gonna no, pull? Just, no, just pull away from me. Ow! <laughs> Freaking hurt. It's like someone's literally ripping my hair out. Okay, ready? Now pull away from me, go. Uh, that one hurts more! I'm not even pulling it. I'm literally just holding my finger here. Yeah, but I'm pulling and it hurts. Okay, pull away, go. My hair's gonna come out. <laughs> We managed to put two holes in your head right here. All right. <laughs> All right, so Tur, let's show them this here real quick. This new kind of style you're thinking. Got two different ones, okay? Okay. Got so. The middle part. <laughs> and then you gotta do the flail up part. <laughs> All right, get in the shower. Let's get this stuff out of here. All right, you guys, Lando Bingham looking all dapper, ready for church. He's borrowing some of Dad's stance socks today. Still rocking his beautiful cast. Now guys, Landon is still wearing shorts because well, pants just don't really fit over that cast just quite yet. We got Ashy Bash looking nice and dapper, rocking his new North Face jacket that we got up when we were skiing. Annabelle, guys, I haven't shown you Annabelle yet. Come here, Annabelle, come here. Sit, 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 sit down. Sit. That's your good girl. Guys, look at Annabelle's outfit here. Look at this. Annabelle, stay there, stay there, stay there, stay there. Yeah. <laughs> and then Miss Ava rocking her nice little church outfit. Hey, do you want to see how long my hair is? Oh, yes, guys. Ava's really proud of her hair. She says the hair gummies that she's been eating, the vitamins, has made her hair much longer. Yeah, Comment down below if you would agree with that. <laughs> so COVID has made going to church a little bit different for us. So since there's a lot of new people on the channel, we are members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. So if you're new here, that is the church that we go to every Sunday. However, with COVID, they have shifted things to at home. So we've been having church at home for a while. And then uh, a couple months ago, they started allowing us to sign up for one Sunday a month. So this is Howard Bingham, are actually our neighbors, their family as well. In case, uh, again, if you guys are new, not knowing that, Brandon and I are brothers. We'll oftentimes sign up on same days of the week, but since we're only allowed to go one time a month, it just kind of varies. So today is our Sunday to be actually dressed up and in church. So church is normally two hours for us, right? So it's actually 45 minutes. 
and then we'll just come home and we'll have some at home, you know, things like that. Anyway, so we're all dressed up, we're ready to go. Hopefully as COVID starts to dissipate, vaccines become more readily available for the rest of the world. Things can kind of go back to normal, but for right now it is one time a month. You are seeing us get it dressed up and go. All right, you guys, we are home from church. Everyone is officially back. So here's what happens. So after the first hour at church, we come back home and then we jump on some virtual meetings. Zoom calls. Yeah, Zoom calls basically, right? But we want to give you a quick update on Turn's hair. Came As out, you can guys. tell. Came out. He's back to being Mr. Rico Suave. Suave. All right, you guys, thank you to everyone who came to Turin's birthday live today. It was a huge success. Turin was definitely feeling the love today. And after kind of a unique birthday, finding out he had a concussion, it definitely put a smile on his face. Tonight, we are continuing the birthday celebrations by having our extended family over to celebrate. We've got my sister and her family coming from my side. We are hoping that Uncle Sean is going to make it home <laughs> in time from the airport to be here tonight, but we're not so sure on that, so stay tuned on that. Daniel and Michelle actually have Daniel's family in town this week, so they won't be able to come tonight. We're gonna miss them so much. As you know, both sets of grandparents are far away. We'll miss them so much. We'll miss Jared and Brittany and my brother and sister and their families, but Brandon and Mindy's family will be here. As you know, we are neighbors. We've got some fun, plans tonight. We are doing a waffle bar. We got some pre-made dough from a local place called Waffle Love, which is so delicious. We go there all the time for dessert. So you can actually buy the dough pre-made, come home and cook it on your own waffle maker. So we've got some of that. We also made some extra confetti dough for the little girls. But over here is the best part. We got chocolate milk because anyone who knows Turin knows that this is his drink of choice. After every soccer practice, he asks me to stop and get him chocolate milk. Chocolate milk, sir? Where you been, Mary? It was like an hour ago. The spoils. We got all the toppings. We got strawberries, bananas, raspberries, more strawberries. It's being so loud. Okay, right here is going to be the homemade whipped cream that Justin and Ava just made homemade, guys. So impressive. High fives. <laughs> right here Sorry. is cookie. Right here is cookie butter. Oh my heavens. Where should I put these? Does anybody want to babysit this guy for a minute? That sounds horrible. So we've got cookie butter, also known as Biscoff. If you don't know about this, you need to know about this. We've got Nutella, we've got powdered sugar, and in here is gonna go homemade buttermilk syrup. So over here, we have been cooking up some buttermilk syrup. Oh, so delicious. Oh, so oh, delicious. Speaking of delicious, was that whipped cream good? Because it's still all over your face. <laughs> and all over your pants. If you've been around here long enough, you know it is one of our favorite traditions to say one thing that we love about the birthday boy or the birthday girl. It's actually a tradition that both Justin and I grew up with and we have continued that in our family. When we have a big gathering with tons of people, sometimes we just move it to one word so we can get through everybody. Did I mention that Maddie's coming tonight? We don't get to see Maddie very often, so we are so excited. She will be here tonight as well. So just so you know, when I told him that you couldn't make it from the airport, he said that you made that up because you wanted to go on a date. How do you know I was even in town? He doesn't know that. He's just saying that you made up that you didn't make what? it back in time. <laughs> and where did you think he was? Where did you think he was, Turbo? It's coming! Oh my god! Oh, anyway. Wow. Hey, let's put it, let's put 
Hazy's feet over at Steve's hut. Well, oh, those go fast. Right. That's, 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 that's like a perfect made for movie really screen. Yeah, that terror screen. Hey, wait, how does the bottom should we sing really quick? <laughs> it's gonna crumble off for it. Oh, it's not one of those ashes. Like, or, or, yeah, ashes, ashes, ashes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Turo, you have a really good personality. Very naturally athletic. That's so nice. Trying to nice to people. <laughs> Thanks, Ava. You are the best big brother. You're very much protective of your little brothers and sister, and sister, sorry. You are a good cousin. I like to play with you. I know Maddie is technically the first cousin, but she's so much older, but you are such a leader for all the little cousins. And so I think it's only thought I might have known you to That's pretty sweet. I've spent some time with Turin lately, taking some math tests. <laughs> you are naturally very smart and you work hard. You've always just been so like nice and polite. You've always had great people skills ever since you were really little like you have this maturity for your age thanks he's blushing oh that's so nice <laughs> uh, so one i'm going to say you're very thoughtful because i'm gonna embarrass you just tiny bit, okay. but he sent a very thoughtful text to Rye Guy the other day that just like most 12 year old, now 13 year old, cousins wouldn't think to send. It was just a thorough, thoughtful, gracious text telling Rye Guy what a great cousin he is and how he's the best cousin somebody could ask for. Wish me a birthday. Well, it's just cool because a lot of people might think that stuff, but they might take the time to share that and you took the time to share it, so I think you're very thoughtful. It's I very, had no very, idea. I didn't yeah. know this happened. I just happened to be standing by Riley when he got it, and it was like kind of longer, and I was like, you know, kids only text like two words usually. He usually. So I look at it, and it's this very kind text about how Riley's like the best cousin somebody could ask for. Thanks for being such a great guy, and da da da. And I was just like, wow, like, I was very impressed with her. Aww. So very thoughtful. Just wondering though if we could take notes like of the text responses that I get, because they're actually very different. Oh, I get K from Riley. <laughs> Yep. yep. Yeah. Up. Mm -hmm. yeah YA. Like uh, YA. Thumbs up. Thumbs up on the desk. <laughs> You're all inclusive, maybe, like a resort almost. <laughs> uh, but but at, at the game yesterday, at Ryder and Turn basketball game yesterday, Turn was identifying that Ryder was open underneath a few times, and he was screaming at the other players Get it to Ryder! He's wide open! <laughs> Rather, rather, rather. So anyways, I knew he was no standing up for Trying to shout out that Ryder was open and give him the ball. I just don't, I just, you know, I was taught if you can't say anything nice, don't say anything nice. <laughs> <laughs> it's Bambi. Don't say nothing at all. No, when I watched the kids, like, a couple weeks ago, Turin is extremely mature, extremely thoughtful, and I was very impressed with him. He just was doing so much that I was definitely not doing at the <laughs> uh, I mean, I wasn't even doing it at my age now. Like, yeah. There are a lot of things, like, even right now. Brushing teeth. I was like... Getting haircuts. <laughs> Look at Lando clapping. Showers and stuff like that. No, but like things just to help with the other kids. I like had no clue what to do and turn were just do. So anyway, I was just really impressed with Turbo, so I love you, dude. 
Yeah. And I love, he loves sports, all the stuff everyone else said, but those were like different things ones. <laughs> Let's be honest, if you didn't come over, they still wouldn't be fine. They would <laughs> <laughs> oh, the best kind of present. See you guys. All right, you guys, thank you for hanging out today. Thank you for joining Turn's birthday party. Thank you for hanging out with the Bingham family and the Adams family and the Garrett family. <laughs> if you're new to our channel, be sure to subscribe down below as always. Turn on those notification bells. See you guys tomorrow morning. Peace, peace, peace.